Hello friends, it is time for days of the week and our number of the week. Let's play our song. day of the week is? That's right, it's Monday. So yesterday was Monday. And if yesterday was Monday, then today is? If you can't remember, go through the song in your head. Sunday, Monday, Tuesday. Good job. And if today is Tuesday, tomorrow is going to be? Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. Good job. All right, friends, let's read. I'm going to point, you help me read. Yesterday was Monday. Today is Tuesday. Tomorrow will be Wednesday. All right, friends, let's see what our you guys remember, what is our number this week? Anybody? That's right, it's the number five. Can you show me five? Yes, okay, let's look at our number path here. And let's put a mark on our number path, or you guys will put your finger on your number path you have at home. Here is our number five. And friends, is five a lonely number or a number pair? Yes, that's right. It's a lonely number because it doesn't have a what? It doesn't have a partner to make a new number. And all lonely numbers go in the, does it go in the tens place or the ones place? Yes, it goes in the ones place. All lonely numbers go in the ones place. And just like when I write my letters, I write my numbers the same way. I start at the top and come down. Small line down and a bump and then put a hat on. That is the numeral five. Now we're gonna write the word five. F, I, V, E. That is the word five. This is the number five. Five. Now we need to count out how many squares. That's right, five. Count this as one. One, two, three, four, five. How many squares did we count? Five, good job friends. Now we need to count out five circles in our 10 frame. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five. Now, we need to look at how many dots in each row and how many dots in, in the columns. So how many dots are in this row? That's right, there's four, look at that. You didn't even have to count, you summatized. Here's the number four. How many are in this row? One, 
Do we have any down in these two rows? Nope, good job, so that would be zero. So we don't need to put that. So four plus one equals, look, you can use your fingers. Four plus one equals, how many fingers do I have up? Five, good job. Look at that math sentence you did. So four plus one equals five, good job. Now we need to look at our columns. How many dots in this column? That's right, there is two. How many dots in this column? One. Yep, good job. And don't forget your plus sign. How many in this column? One. Good job. How many in this column? Yes, good job. So two plus one plus one plus one equals, how many dots do we have here all together? That's right, five. Good job. You just did two math sentences, friends. Good job. Kiss your brain. So smart. Have a good day.